Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody asked the question how you could easily divide a rectangle that's not an even number into three parts, both the width and the length equally. Several ways to do it. I would, because you could get out a calculator and figure out, but it would never be, unless you extend this number out further, it would be exactly. But the blend tool is going to do it exactly. So just take you a two point line, make it longer than your box is. Uh, hit the plus key and or seat keyboard and I've got snap two on and I'm going to hold down the shift key and select both these. I'm going to blend them twice. That is exactly one third. My suggestion is to start drawing a straight line, hold down the control button, make it longer than your item. Hit the plus sign and key on your keyboard and have it snap two, and then shift select that one in the, in the same thing. I guarantee these are dead on. Let's take that one and that one and let's measure them. And we're going to measure them to the max. This one says it's 648. This one says 648337. They're exactly the same, but let's let's extend it out further. Let's go to tools, options, Corel draw, edit, and change our distance to six decimal places. Now you're going to have to check off that so Corel can change it because it's changing it right now. Now this thing is 6.475185. 6.47185, exactly the same. 3371102, 3371102. So that's how if you need accuracy, um, you know, even if you moved it with a calculator, unless you extended the number out this far, the blend tool is going to be accurate. So if you needed something divided by ever how many times, and it is basically a rectangle, you can do that. You know, you can make all the different shapes in the world uh, and make them all 100% equal. Hope that helped. Thank you for watching.